from the director of Porky's comes the Christmas classic you've seen a thousand times by now. Fragile! It must, must be, be Italian. Italian. I a triple dog, dog dare you. Oh, fudge. Wait, is this movie even good? Or do we just like it because we have the whole thing memorized? A Christmas Story. This holiday season, when everyone in your family starts yelling at each other, put on a Christmas story and enter the warm confines of a nostalgia turducken. <laughs> in a film that looks back fondly on the childhood the narrator looks back fondly on, that makes you look back fondly on watching it as a kid, and return to the American Midwest in the broke-ass 30s, where listening to the radio is considered fun. You could still smack a kid around for laughs. <laughs> And all the toys sucked. The real Great Depression? Trying to have fun with a wagon full of raggedy hands. Hey, while I have you here, anyone want to sell me their PS5? Meet Ralphie. Back before he got hot and executive produced Iron Man. Follow along on his single-minded quest to acquire a firearm and fight against America's only form of gun control. Parents. No, shoot your eye out. As this little boy spends the entire film scheming for a gun. I want an official Red Rider Carbon Action 200 Joe Wayne's Ball Air Rifle. Dreaming about a gun and making up outlandish threats to justify owning a gun. What if you do come back? You'll be pushing up daisies. Is that what it feels like to be a Republican? Gather around for a film that isn't really about family or generosity or Christmas, but more about crass materialism, survival, and the universal holiday message of stop snitching. You ready to tell me? <laughs> Ralphie, do you know where Flick is? There is a family in it though, and boy is this one hanging by a thread. Dad's got rage issues. Papa says! Mom's on the verge of a nervous breakdown. My mother had not had a hot meal for herself in 15 years. And the little brother is a ball of anxiety and eating disorders held together by parkas. Tell mommy how the piggies eat. You just know they're about to shatter faster than a <clears throat> accidentally broken leg lamp. Dad, you use up all the glue on purpose. Bask in the warmth of Gene Shepard's radio voice. The greatest Christmas gift I had ever received or would ever receive. As you revisit his favorite Christmas, where he got attacked in the streets, had a mental breakdown, ate soap, got betrayed by his favorite show, got kicked in the head by Santa, finally got what he wanted for Christmas, and immediately shot himself in the face with it. Oh my God, I shot my eye out. Dear Lord, if this is the happiest time of his life, I'd hate to see what happened the other years. Did he have to work in a coal mine? Did Krampus get him? So whip up some Ovaltine and enjoy a movie that's like old cinematic wallpaper. It's chipped and faded and we should probably replace it. <laughs> but at the same time, it's comforting and familiar and we'll never get around to trying something new. Cause sure, you could watch Elf if you want to laugh out loud, which also has Peter Billingsley in it. Or throw on Netflix to see whatever random word the algorithm decided to pair with Christmas. But you know you'll just tune it to TNT or TBS and watch a Christmas story yet again. Stuck in the same loop of conflict and catharsis you can never escape from, no matter how old you get. Huh, I guess it is a movie about family after all. Starring Fudge Dread, The Player's Ball, <laughs> Flagpole Licka. I love lab. I hate lab. Billy Bob Thornton. And yellow eyes are a sign of liver disease. He should really get that checked out. <laughs> Scud Farkas? How did you get in here? I heard you were slapping your soup suckers together, tucking some trash about me, calling me some names. That wasn't me. Honest. Do you want atomic wedgie? How about a purple nurple? We made my famous Indian arm burn. Hey, uh, ow! Uh, ow! Oh, how about I just grab your own hand? Why are you hitting yourself? Why are you hitting yourself? Ow! You want me to stop? You better say it. You, you better say it! <laughs> ow! Uncle! Uncle! <laughs> a Christmas sketch show. <sighs> Jerk Farkas. Stupid bully. You know, setting aside that Ralphie probably wrote a rant about his gun, the C plus is probably because he misspelled Christmas. Time to go lick a frozen pole. Kids, it's little often anytime. Be sure to drink your Ovaltine? I want an official Red Rider Carbon Action 200 shot range model air rifle. <laughs>